Hi, it's Jeff Chalmers here from discoverdoublebass.com. That's the home of online double bass lessons. So if you're interested in more like this one, please go and check that out after this video. Now, today I'm gonna to be answering a question uh, from one of the members of the Discover Double Bass study group, which is a sort of support group for people who've bought one of the courses on the website. And Sid was asking me about the balance of the bass and a problem he was having with the bass going this way that was affecting the way that he used arm weight. So what I'm gonna do is answer Sid's question and really explore this whole issue of the balance of the bass and how it comes to rest against you and really troubleshoot any problems that you might be having. So let's get into it now. The problem that Sid was having is a fairly common one and it's that the bass feels like it wants to go past you to your left. So the weight is coming back this way and you end up squeezing with the left hand and you're struggling to use arm weight. And in fact, when you do use arm weight, you're pulling the base past you. Now I've had several students in the last few months come to me with this issue. Um, and I think that there's a, a bit of a problem going on, which I maybe didn't address in some of my other posture lessons. So I'd like to clarify that here. So let's start from the beginning. The base should be vertical, grab hold of the neck heel, and allow the instrument to come back towards you, as we've discussed in my posture lesson on YouTube and in the beginner's course, which is, uh, gives you a bit more detail on this. But anyway, the bass is coming back towards you, it's leading into you. And the problem is you then play and the bass wants to go over in this direction. Now, as we know, we don't want the ribs coming flat against us and we don't want the back flat against us. We want this angle. And we also don't want to have to rely on using our left knee to position the bass as well, because otherwise, all of our weight is on my right leg. So what we need to do is adjust the angle so the scroll is pointing towards my head. So I'd like you to try and stand like this. And the reason is, is that I feel uh, that the problems that I've been seeing students having are related to the base being slightly too forward on like this and the weight naturally wanting to go in this direction so it falls away. What I'd like you to do is position it slightly further across this way and so it points uh, kind of above my head or over my right shoulder. Now the good thing about this is when I come to use arm weight, it just pulls down naturally. I'm kind of pulling the base into me. It's coming to rest against my belt um, and it's on this angle. Now also the use of jazz pits helps stabilize the instrument as does using the bow to a point as well. But just really make sure that the angle that your scroll is pointing at is sort of towards your head and past it and try and get used to the balance point like I am now. I'm not having to support it. I just correct it as needed. And then when I'm playing, I'm not having any tension in my arm. And I can just let the let gravity do the work to help me keep those strings down. So it was just a really quick lesson today. I wanted to outline this problem in case you are having the issue yourself. Um, if you want more information on posture, there's a really comprehensive uh, set of lessons within my beginners course. And there's also a lesson on YouTube that you can check out for free as well. Plus any questions, you can join the conversation in the comments below this video and I'll get back to you and help out if I can. So best of luck with your practice and I'll see you in the next lesson.